is going on everyone? It's me, James here from Triple Threat FIFA, and today I have my blue snowball mic. Yeah! You know, get excited guys, because um, I'm going to have clear, awesome audio. I'm not going to have any background stuff. You will be able to hear me over the music. Sometimes I will sound louder. Sometimes I will not sound louder, but uh, I'm going to try and do my best to... Uh, I, I provide a clear commentary. <coughs> but uh, today we're doing a Liverpool FIFA 15 player rating prediction video. Um, second in the league, you know, don't think of it as a, as a failure, think of it as a success, because you're back in the Champions League, um, you know, last year you finished seventh, your, your main objective was to, uh, get in Champions League, and you've done that, so don't feel as, don't, and you beat Chelsea as well, and Arsenal, so don't feel as a, a um, failure, look at it as a success. And, uh, but yeah, so I picked out five players, like I always do, and now uh, let's get into it. First player I have is Simon Mignolet, or Simon Mignolet. He's been called up to the Belgian national team, um, probably going to be second behind Courtois, although he has had a relatively good season, I think it's 10 clean sheets, which isn't too bad, actually, in your debut season. Uh, plus two diving, plus one handling, plus one positioning, I just realized I was so far away. And um, he looks, he looks, um, that, that would actually be a pretty good card. Um, you know, he doesn't deserve any more than 83. He does not deserve a downgrade, but I think just a minor upgrade will do it for him. Next we have Luis Suarez. Um, <laughs> what can I say? I think he's got 31 goals this whole season. You know, that card may look, you know, the differences may look so um, weird, but that's probably what he deserves, to be honest with you guys. Plus one pace, um, because, you know, when they get in their prime, they obviously get faster, they get better, you know, dribbling plus one, you may, th may think that's maybe a little too much, maybe it is, maybe it isn't, but, um, I think he deserves that, plus four shooting, because if you get 31 goals in one league, you, do not, you have to have near 90 shooting, and passing is really good, because he, he's also got the most amount of assists in the BPL this last season, plus four heading as well, and, uh, Defending, so just probably minor upgrades to dribbling and defending, but you know, pace. But the rest, he much deserves 90. If he doesn't get 90 rated, that is an abomination, and uh, yeah, you're stupid. Next, we have Daniel Sturridge. Uh, I am a bold person, so I will be giving players big upgrades. You'll see this in later videos, you know, whenever I do like Arsenal and stuff, you know, like Ozil, you know, he's gonna. I actually haven't made him yet, but, uh, you know, you're just gonna see what I, I think he sh they should get, or he should get, because there's no women I'm covering, because I, I've, to be honest, I have no idea about women's soccer, but I'm not gonna get into that, because now that makes me sound rex sexist, but, uh, anyways, just kidding, um, ignore that, but, um, he doesn't need any more pace, shooting plus six, because he, he's got 20, 20 plus goals in the BPR, that's amazing, second on the list. Um, passing plus 10 because he, he is pretty good. He's got a lot of assists. He's getting better. Um, plus 7 heading because he's actually pretty good at heading. He's tall. He's tall. Um, of course, when he does his uh, celebration, uh, that's hilarious. It's nice to see him dribbling because I think he's a really good dribbler. I think that this card would be pretty good. Um, I'm sorry. Oh, crap. Go back. Anyway, so we're just move on to the next player, but uh, Steven, Steven Gerrard now. Oh, well, there we go, just kidding. Well, yeah, what's it doing? Okay, so I'm sorry guys about that. But uh, so next player we have Steven G. I basically took his um, inform card and, modif and made it a goal because, let's be honest, he kind of deserves this. Pace will go down, obviously. But passing, he's, passing and shooting, he's still on it. Like, he is still pretty good. Um, dribbling plus two. May maybe those are a little extreme. But he has had such a good season, especially after January. He's had such a good season. He's probably he's been you know the anchor of the midfield. He's been so good, so influential, showing off his captaincy very well. And um, he, he deserves an upgrade. Um, maybe not all of them. I think he will go down in probably pace and heading, but maybe defending plus one and dribbling plus one, and then passing plus. I think plus one and everything except pace and heading which will go down by one but uh that's what i think ea will give him but what he deserves is probably that so so good to see and then lastly we have raheem sterling this is pretty quick um but um i because i have a lot of stuff to talk to at the end but uh raheem sterling he's had a great season plus four 
on his rating, plus 19 shooting, plus 13 passing, plus 4 dribbling, plus 2 defending, plus 3 heading. He's been so good this season. And I mean, not just like, eh. He's probably been the be one of the best wingers. He's been up there with Hazard and, you know, David Silva if you if you want to do that. But he's been so good this season. He so deserves to um have those upgrades. Definitely. Plus, plus 19 shooting might be a little too much. Maybe plus 10 at first, you know, and then when he FIFA 16, maybe he gets 78 or something, but he, he's been so good, and I watched him, he, he's grown up so much, so quick, this season, you know, he started kind of bad, and then went off like a rocket ship, as soon as SAS started coming in, he's been the SNS, SASNS, Star Suarez and Sterling, they've just been such a good attacking combination, they fired basically Liverpool in the second, so that's pretty good. But, um, so this is gonna be the end of the video, guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, I'm gonna be doing five more over the weekend. Also, get ready for my World Cup series. Uh, I'm gonna be doing that, and, um, <clears throat> that'll be pretty fun. I'm gonna be, what I'm gonna, I've changed the things, so basically, what I'm gonna be doing, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be going over the national teams and picking my, my 11. Um, I'm doing, I'm doing England and Germany soon, the weekend, I'm doing Italy and Spain, and then you guys need to leave comments on what I should do next. Thank you guys for watching, hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you, see you next time, but also, Twitter, 